happening right now. The Livermore Police Department is working to fight back against catalytic converter theft. Yeah, they've partnered with Las Positas College to offer free catalytic converter etching all day. ABC 7 News reporter Lena Hallen joins us live from the college in Livermore where the etching is well underway. Lena? Hey, Kristen, good morning to you. We are at the college's automotive department where all day long students are etching catalytic converters for drivers at no cost to them. The goal is to make it easier for police to track stolen converters and to discourage thieves from taking them at, in the first place. Tucked underneath hundreds of cars, Las Positas College students are etching for a purpose. As the college, we like to do it because as a service to the community, but not only that, for my students, I like to do it because it shows them what it's like to actually work in a real life shop. Partnering with Livermore Police to etch catalytic converters with a unique identification number, making them less attractive to thieves and easier to trace if stolen. That's one of the hardest things with these catalytic converter thefts is that we as police officers will recover, let's say, a trunk of 50 catalytic converters. Um, and there's no serial number on them uh, or anything to tie them to who the rightful owner is. So this gives us something to follow up on. This is the fifth time they've hosted this event free for all community members since 2022, with around 300 cars coming through each time. And since then, the Livermore Police Department says it's working. They say in 2022, the first year they started this program, the city had nearly 300 reported converter thefts. Last year was almost two thirds less at 91. And the numbers this year are on track to make 2024 the lowest on record with just eight reported thefts so far. In our um, perspective of that is that, yeah, this is actually working as a visual deterrent because when somebody crawls underneath the vehicle, um, the hope is that they're going to start knowing that it has that badge on there and that it's trackable and that it's not worth messing with. And, and the program has already come full circle with Livermore police on the receiving end of calls from other departments where their etched converters stamped with the police seal have been recovered. Everyone cheered and they were all happy and it, and it kind of encouraged them, right? You know, the, it, this this for them is, is kind of another day in the shop, so to speak. So when they hear stories like that, they're happy that they're making a ch positive change in the world. And you have until 3 o'clock this afternoon to get in line in order to get this done today. And if you missed today's event, they are planning to host another one in early May before the students head home for summer break. Live in Livermore, Lena Howland, ABC 7 News. All right. Thank you so much, Lena.